cầu nguyện cầu nguyện và sau đó tất cả chúng mọi thứ ta lên ta lên ta đến tận thiên đường from your friend, Sergeant Hines. When you wandered off, your unit thought you had deserted. Wanted you court-martialed. You're still drawn to it. You have to kill it, yeah? <sighs> Too late, though. River God did this three days ago. Get some men up here to clean this up. Come on, let's head out. I have something to show you.
Big Palmer. Yeah, Major Brickerson. Chase Doc told me you might be able to shed some light on some things for us. We got our asses whipped by a VC ambush. We wait for reinforcements. When those soldiers came, they were, uh... They were monsters in the shape of men. Uh, they wouldn't die, not by shooting them. So we retreated to Firebase Tar Heel, or we tried to, but Tar Heel is gone. It's just fucking gone. That's when I called an airstrike. We lit that jungle on fire. We burned everything. There he was, just standing there. Not running. No pain. Invisible. Except for the napalm just sticking to him. Something I'll never be able to explain. This doesn't make sense. Look, I'm not here to connect the dots for you. The events at Tar Heel are classified. I got men in this unit I trust. Men I know, men I shed blood with. And they're saying things happen to them that they can't explain. My boys are saying they saw the devil. The devil. Yes. I want your men to help us kill the devil. I think the CIA better start to explain what the fuck is going on here, or you're gonna have a mutiny on your hands. Please state your name. Bracken. Corporal Richard Bracken, sir. All right. Please recount the events at Firebase Tar Heel. How did you get burned? What happened? They started weird. There was some, uh, something along the riverbank. Seals have found it. Call came down for us to get some intel on it. The camera guys and aircraft were sent with us. We saw it. It was, uh... I don't know what it was. What happened to Firebase Tar Heel, Corporal? We were shooting everywhere. One minute I'm in the jungle, looking at that thing. And the next I'm in South Carolina, back on the day we were gonna deploy. I don't mean like a dream or nothing. I mean, I was in America. And? The planes, they were all destroyed. 
and we're under attack. There was Russian aircraft. But not like Megs or nothing. Cobain flame napalm. And everyone was burning. They were burning us. Soldiers burning. Like hell. in a Charleston Air Base? Are they all dead? Charleston's safe. No, but it did happen. It did. Because then, uh... Freddie and the boys, they pulled me out of the ditch. House still on fire. Here. Yeah, here, in the jungle. I was like, here again, but on fire. Like they pulled me out of South Carolina into Vietnam. Buddies were along the riverbank. He's raising the dead up like ghosts. He's making their uh, their insides like heart, like a cockroach. But they look like spiders or something. if anyone else had seen uh, the god. No one else had. Thank you, Sergeant Bracken. Well, Corporal Bracken will be flown back to the States, enrolled in MK search, and his name will be stricken off the rolls here. He'll officially be MIA, along with the 318 other Americans lost at Tar Heel. As of this moment, Firebase Tar Heel never existed. Get some rest. We head out in a few hours. I don't want to sleep anymore. Try.
all these men. They're gonna die tonight, you know that, right? I'm not sure you care if these soldiers live or die. Uh, you don't even care if you live or die. Maybe that's how it works. Who are you? What are you becoming? These details are slipping away from you, aren't they? I can help. Because I have these dreams, more like visions. It's trying to tell me something. I just can't understand what it's saying. It just sounds like noise. to soldiers in your previous unit. I've heard all the accounts about you. Hines isn't meant to die. Hines is protected by a divine hand. Objects were put in your path to shield you. Put there to protect you at exactly the right moment. To shield you from the right piece of shrapnel. It's almost as if life itself knew you were coming. The universe keeping you alive, saving you as though it has a plan for you. God? That man you're compelled to hunt? He is an error. A mistake, plain and simple. Life wants him gone. But what is he? A simple villager. He had no connection to the Viet Cong. He had a wife. He had children. He was pushed by grief to the point where the very fabric tore around him. The local villagers who knew him, they began calling him the River God. And he wandered the Mekong, leaving a wake of destruction. I don't even think he knows he's doing these things. These horrors, manifesting reality through his subconscious thoughts, changing matter inside the dead, reanimating them as visions of his own hell. Eventually, he wandered into an NBA base, begging for help. And by that point, his flesh had entirely burned off. Visibility. Telepathy. As a god walking the earth, his mind is set free. We will set the jungle on fire, burn everything until flaming gel splatters across him, lighting him up for us to track. We will find him. This is the electromagnetic coil gun. It's firing projectiles at about 120 at the speed of light. Now this, this is the real jewel. It creates a magnetosphere, positive, negative polarity. 
Everything about this is designed to keep reality unbroken so you can function. You will be protected from the breakdown in space-time. We call it a relativity capsule. It amplifies the gift you already have. Thank you.